Okay. With this, I don't think we could call names before, but I don't think we could call the names and the papers with this. That's why we need com uh, community radios. And uh, Julius Niba will be telling us about a community radio in Gogutunja called the Gogutunja Community Radio. Students do go there at this present time to listen to their, or to get their names and to get all other information that concerns them. All right, let's go find out. Hello, welcome to Gogutunja. As you know, communication is one of the most important tools in the 21st century. And as you're watching now, the stone that you're looking at is in Gokutunja, uh, stone wherein the name of the, the, the division comes from. And this is also the basis for the radio station that you're like seeing the board behind us now, the Gokutunja Radio FM, which has brought so much to this population out here. It has given them the access to communication. It gives them the opportunity to communicate within themselves. And of course, to solve one of those two problems that they face in the region. In this slide, we are now in Gokutunja to go to this radio station and also find out from these people how they make use of this radio, how it brings them together, how it passes on information within them as a community, and of course how it helps them here yeah, as a people. So once more, you're welcome to Gokutunja as we bring you to this radio station that will tell you more about information and communication in the region. Stay tuned. This is Hello You're Watching. Good morning, Mr. Manager. What does the radio do to this people, uh, population out here? Yes, the radio came here to uh, salvage the information salvation in uh, the division because uh, for quite some time the division had uh, no access to information. Since we cannot have access to uh, other media uh -huh. the, around the division because this is the only radio around the division, mm -hmm. uh, so we encounter some of those difficulties. We are forced to use. Uh, uh, phones, the, the other communication way to uh, get information from uh, friends who are out of the Which division. is very important, of course. And knowing that the media is meant to educate, to inform and also to entertain, how does your program put this together to make sure that the people really have something worthful from your radio station? Yes, we've put in place uh, programs uh, as far as uh, school activities are concerned because we have a program for uh, the various schools in the division. Mm -hmm. uh, we equally have uh, programs like Road to Success, for example. Mm -hmm. If uh, there are many children around the radio today to check for their results, it's because of uh, uh, the program Road to Success where we had to educate them as far as uh, uh, the, the, their success is concerned. All right, now we see that, as we earlier said, there are some students around who would like to talk, of, talk to some of them to know what brings them here. And of course, good morning. Yeah. So how are you doing? Yeah, okay. All right, we want to ask you, is there any information that you gain, particularly listening to Ngokutunja Radio? Well, uh, yes, 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 actually. But apart from the information, we have uh, very educative programs okay. you know, that help us to use. Yeah. And also, apart from bringing in information mm -hmm. to the people, there are also programs that uh, in which the problems of the people are presented. All right. And, uh, so, you are a student, I do you presume? Yeah. Did yeah. you come to check on your results? Yeah. Sure. Hope you made it. Yeah. All right. Now, and of course, talking to the next person beside him, we would also like to know from you are there some times or some programs that you're not really, really, you know, really happy with as far as Ngoko Chinja Radio is concerned? Maybe they're discriminatory, maybe they don't help the youths or they are not really in light of what you think would help the community out here? No, actually, all the programs which they are running here is very good. Mm -hmm. Yes, and I really appreciate it, but it shows that I highly join them in, what, in the programs they are doing. Yes. All right, thank you so much. We'll move to the last person, and of course, putting men together without a lady wouldn't make sense. That's one to talk to a very pretty lady here. Good morning. Good morning. So please, what's your name? And do you perform any services here in Gokutunja Radio? Yes, of I course. The commercial section. Commercial section, yes. which implies you bring so much revenue into the house. Well, especially. That's nice to know. <laughs> of course, please tell us more about your services here at the well, radio. Announcements pass through me. Mm -hmm. Yes. The only problem that I have is just that uh, people they bring in the announcement. Yes. So the prices. When they ask them to pay announcement for 1,000 francs, mm -hmm. they will always complain that 
they don't have money, that the money is too much. And therein we understand that there's a, a little bit of understanding between you, yeah. the office, and of course the people who do come here. Yeah. But in a nutshell, we do presume that everything is moving on well. No, everything is moving on video. well, but concerning finances, normally. That's difficult for most persons. Yeah. At the end of the day, we so want to thank you so much. You have have, okay, yeah, please go on. We don't receive Bamenda radio here in Bokutunja. Wow. Yes, we don't That's receive Bamenda. Then it is... That's CRTV Bamenda. CRTV Bamenda. Okay. Yes, we don't receive CRTV Bamenda well. here in Bokutunja. All right, that's the only problem you face then. Yes. We do presume that and we understand that the authorities concerned are listening to us, are, are watching and listening to us at the moment. We want to thank you very much. And of course, stay tuned with CRU TV. Yeah, it has been Gokutinja Radio. And we have so much to show you. Go nowhere. Hello. It's the farming season in Babungo, and uh, it's time for harvesting that we have here. We have the plantain, we have the cocoa plums, we have the corn, the beans, and you know there's also one thing about Babungo is the rice farm. They do a lot of cultivation of rice. You know that rice is something that Cameroonians consume a lot, and we still have scarcity. So when you will discover the rice farm in Babungo, you might want to bring up your ideas to see how we might promote that kind of agriculture in Cameroon. But I will stay here, okay? I will stay here and do watching and harvesting. strike in February, the government has been taking measures and uh, encouraging farmers to improve upon their yields. And here in Ngokutinja Division, we know that uh, they cultivate rice and corn fields. So we are here with this group of farmers who are cultivating rice and corn. And we would like to know from Fa, who is uh, one of uh, uh, the farmers, Fa, how are you doing? Well, we are doing